first stage of this design, we wanted to hide the carbon fiber strips, so we taped off as close to them as possible, following the line of the rails. Then, we measured and taped off the stripes on one side. To ensure the angles are the same on the other side, we made sure the tape intersected perfectly at the stringer. By using the stringer as a guide, we are able to easily make the stripes the same on both sides. Next, we wanted to do the dry brush technique to create a fade in the middle. It's best to use a cheap paintbrush that doesn't have very dense bristles. It's important to keep the paintbrush dry. You can't get the right effect if it's wet. Once the paint is on the brush, you might need to dab some of it off using a rag. If there's too much paint on the brush, it won't look right. You can shift the angle of the brush as you blend the paint. Keep working the colors together and build the layers until you get the fade that you want. Always be sure the colors you are blending work well together. For example, orange and green would make brown and it just wouldn't look good. Thank you for watching our video. Check out other technique videos on how to grom your board at gromit.com.